You're not going to believe what AMD just dropped at Computex 2025. I mean, if you thought last year was wild for PC hardware, buckle up, because AMD just rewrote the playbook for both gamers and creators. Alright, let's dive in. AMD just announced their brand new Radeon RX 8950 XT graphics card, and it's a beast. We're talking next generation RDNA 4 architecture, double the ray tracing performance, and a massive leap in AI accelerated gaming features. That means faster frame rates, better visuals, and yeah, your games are about to look unbelievable. But here's what really knocked my socks off. The new Ryzen Threadripper 9000 series processors. The flagship model, 96 cores, not threads, cores. That's basically like having a small data center sitting under your desk, ready to chew through 8K video editing, 3D rendering, or, you know, 400 Chrome tabs at once. If you're a creator, or even just someone who loves to push hardware to the edge, this is your dream chip. Let's talk specs for a second. The Radeon RX 8950 XT features 32 GB of GDDR7 memory, PCIe Gen 5 support, and real-time path tracing. AMD claims up to 80% better performance per watt compared to the last gen. That means cooler, quieter, and way more efficient gaming rigs. Oh, and they're pushing smart access storage even further, so loading times? Practically gone. Jumping back to Threadripper, the 9000 series supports quad-channel DDR5 RAM and up to 128 PCIe Gen 5 lanes. Translation, your storage and GPUs can finally run at full throttle, no bottlenecks. And with AMD's new AI engine baked right in, workloads like machine learning or generative AI? Off the charts. But it's not just about raw numbers. AMD also showed off new cooling solutions and motherboards built specifically for these monster chips. So upgrading? Way easier than you'd think. Honestly, this is a huge leap, not just for AMD fans, but for the whole industry. Whether you're gaming at ultra settings, streaming, or running a full-on workstation from home, AMD's new lineup is built to handle it all. So, what do you think? Is this the year AMD finally takes the crown from the competition? Drop your thoughts in the comments. I want to know what you'd do with 96 cores and that much GPU horsepower. If you enjoyed this breakdown, go ahead and hit that like button, subscribe for more deep dives on the latest tech, and ring the bell so you never miss out on the next big reveal. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next one.